Utah is known for its beautiful landscapes and stunning vistas. What's not as well known is the vast potential for renewable geothermal energy resources that lie beneath the surface. Small portions of this resource reach us via hot springs. They are clues of the expansive energy below our feet. Utah currently ranks third in the nation behind California and Nevada for utility scale geothermal electricity generation and is one of only seven states tapping this resource. Utah geothermal power plants have a capacity of 73 megawatts and generated 410 gigawatt hours in 2024, enough to power about 38,000 homes. That is only 0.1% of the total estimated undeveloped potential of 49,400 megawatts, which could power nearly 49 million homes meaning Utah's geothermal energy resources have almost unlimited potential for future power generation. And unlike intermittent renewable energy such as wind and solar, geothermal energy can supply a steady baseload of electricity 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Utah is already home to three privately owned and operated geothermal plants. All three plants are traditional hydrothermal systems. Two of the plants, Cofort and Thermo, utilize binary cycle technology to generate electricity. Binary systems move the naturally heated waters, also known as geothermal fluids, through a heat exchanger, where thermal energy is then transferred to a second fluid with a lower boiling point. The second fluid, also called a working fluid, turns to vapor in a process called flashing. The superheated vapor pushes a turbine connected to a generator, and the resulting electricity is added to the regional power grid. The geothermal fluids are then re-injected back into the ground to be recirculated and reheated. The Blundell geothermal plant uses geothermal fluid from deep underground. Production wells do not require pumping because the fluids expand and partially flash to steam as they depressurize on their ascent to the surface. The steam drives a turbine to generate electricity and the remaining geothermal fluid passes through a binary cycle system to create additional electricity. Residual geothermal fluid is then injected into the subsurface, primarily to provide pressure support to the reservoir for sustainability. Northeast of Milford, the University of Utah operates the Utah Frontier Observatory for Research in Geothermal Energy, also known as Utah Forge. Since 2015, Utah Forge has been developing and testing the commercial viability of Enhanced Geothermal Systems, or EGS a groundbreaking new technology that could help advance the uptake of geothermal resources around the world. EGS is a human-made, engineered geothermal reservoir, created in hot rock that is lacking permeability in order to mobilize geothermal fluids and extract heat energy. Multiple wells are directionally drilled adjacent to each other, and the rock between them is fractured, so injected water can permeate between the wells. Water is injected thousands of feet down into the fractured formation, where it picks up thermal energy from the hot rocks and returns via an adjacent production well. The now hot water is used to generate electricity through a steam turbine if hot enough or a binary cycle system on the surface. Once the heat energy is extracted, the spent water is then recirculated back into the ground and the cycle continues. Near Utah Forge, Fervo Energy's Cape Station project is underway. It is the first EGS site being developed for commercial electrical power generation. Fervo is drilling numerous EGS wells and constructing power plants and transmission facilities. The first phase of the project is on schedule to produce 90 megawatts by 2026, and the second phase will produce 400 megawatts by 2028, with even more expansion potential beyond. Advanced Geothermal Systems, also called AGS, are new forms of geothermal production. AGS wells are entirely closed loop systems. Using advanced drilling technology, two or more wells are drilled deep into hot rocks or sediments and connected together. A working fluid is circulated through the system where it captures heat energy from below to generate electricity on the surface using a binary cycle system. The working fluid is then recirculated into the closed loop system. Geothermal energy provides a clean, sustainable, consistent power source and is one of many renewable energy resources the state is using to power our future. Geothermal energy resources are paramount, largely untapped, 
naturally occurring assets that are sustainable, renewable, and provide many benefits that outweigh other energy resources. Utah continues to lead the way in the development of these new technologies and is yet to scratch the surface of our geothermal potential.